So go to items and services list to see whether we already have a discount account or not. And search discount here in this field. And here you can see that after searching, nothing showed up. It means no discount account has been set up so far. So to set up one, click on new under item. Here under the type field, select discount. You can name it whatever you want and write the description if there is a need. And also you can make it a sub account too. And here in this field, you have both the options, either you can add your discount in terms of dollar amount or in terms of percentage. Remember, if you put it as a percentage, you have to add the percentage sign too. Anyhow, here you need to assign an account to it so that QuickBooks can track it properly. If you already have one, just select it. And if you don't, click on add new and create one. Well, you can create and assign either an income or expense account to it. If you create an income account, it will track it as a negative value and will show its impact under gross profit. And if you create an expense account, it will track it as a positive value and will show its impact under net profit. So it's really a matter of choice how you want to track it. And in this tutorial, I'm creating it as an income account to assign and track it. And here you can see that the discount account has been created and assigned. And then click on OK.